what's up you guys my name is Jen and this is Through Thick and Thin today it is way in Wednesday where we obviously weigh in and talk about how this past week went and how we're gonna improve for next week uh, so let's talk about how last week went I so last week I lost two pounds and I think I was really really motivated and it was like it's go time you know and I think after that happened and I lost the two pounds, I think I probably got a little more relaxed than I should have um, because I started like eating maybe a little bigger portions. I, uh, I just ate more dense foods than I had been the previous week. Um, so I wasn't expecting a whole lot this week to be honest with you. I did, however, I did keep up on my exercise, um, I think I exercised every single day this week, I can show you right here, um, that I did in fact do all my exercises. So yeah, I did plan out all my meals, I just think that maybe I ate a little bit too much, um, and or maybe I could have made them a little bit healthier meals. I don't remember if I ate out this past week, so I'm gonna say no. I don't, I don't remember eating out. No. But I did, I did have, I remember I had like a pesto ravioli one night, you know, so it's like things that maybe I shouldn't be having all the time if I'm trying to lose weight, you know? So, all of that uh, being said, I did lose this week, although it was not a crazy amount. I am down 0.2. I weighed in at 238.2 this morning and last week I was 238.4 so progress it's not the biggest amount of progress but for the longest time I wasn't losing anything and for the longest time if anything I was gaining so I'm gonna take it I did lose two pounds last week so it evens out it's fine so my goal is for next week instead of saying that I want to lose one pound which I would love that right um my goal is going to be to stick to my meal plan every single day. So if you didn't know, I use a planner to plan out my entire week's worth of meals. And then the goal is to stick to that and then I lose weight. So my goal for next week is to stick to that 100%. And then, um, oh, and if you want to like learn how to use a planner to help your weight loss, I can link that. I don't know which side it's on, it's one of these two. I also want to keep exercising every single day. I will say my exercises are not always crazy intensive like yesterday I did some yoga and I didn't burn a whole lot of calories but I felt amazing you guys and I think that's important to know that exercise is not always just for losing weight and burning calories it's to keep your body like mind soul whatever all in line so uh, while I didn't get a whole lot of calories burned yesterday from that workout I felt great and I feel like all loose and limber today so uh, and then today uh, this morning I spent an hour gardening and I burned almost 500 calories and then I'm going to go for a walk later with my dogs. So yeah, I just, I'm going to keep up with the consistency or I want to dial up the consistency rather, but I'm going to stick to my meal plan um, and then I'm just going to keep making small changes, you know, uh, dialing back the eating out. I don't think I ate out last week again. Um, so I have like two more weeks of not eating out and then we can start maybe revisiting that again. And then I still have two more weeks of exercise every single day. That's my uh, challenge for myself in the month of May. I have missed one day so far, but I think one out of everything is good to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave this video here. If you haven't already, leave me a like down below. Uh, it really helps me out and I appreciate it so much. And uh, we are almost to 300 members of our Fit Fam. We would love to have you. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe down below and ring that bell for notifications. Uh, I do post every single day, Monday through Friday, and then I do take the weekends off. So make sure to not miss that video every single day. Remember, you can make today a great day. Or not, the choice is yours. Have a good one.